Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Uh, I gotta tell you guys, uh, as you saw probably already, uh, there is a beauty in the struggle and that beauty is the Piron coins for me. I really uh, wasn't mm, meant to be making this video because I wasn't expecting that I'm gonna have to make the video, but in a way I'm glad that uh, this uh, problem has occurred so I can obviously share uh, with you what I experienced and hopefully give you some solution so if you are experiencing the same problem you can fix it or hopefully you can prevent it so it never happened to you guys so let me tell you what happened guys for some reason Windows decided to uh, turn on the updates and do some updates as we know Windows likes to do that and when that happens sometimes we occur problems and the problem for me was as soon as the updates were done and I discovered this few hours after it happened the rig wasn't working uh, because the cards were not recognized as you can see here sorry about the bad picture they simply wasn't recognized so the rigs uh, the rig it couldn't work uh, so it was a uh, an immediate disappointment and obviously shock because I knew I had uh, some problems to that I need to fix first thing first immediately I, I went for is to go to obviously the device manager so right here I went to the display adapters right click on the ones were not recognized uh, update driver click on the browse the computer where I have my driver click next but I kept getting this message guys the best drives for your device are already installed now I had obviously been dealing with this for a while so I said you know what hold on I'm gonna fix you don't worry about it so I went for the uh, AMD let me show you right here uh, let me close this so I went for my AMD software program I started the program and uh, at that point I uh, proceeded to uninstall the driver I said I'm gonna uninstall the drivers and then I'm gonna reinstall the same drivers and hopefully we'll fix it well I did the uninstalling guys I then installed the same drivers I had but that unfortunately didn't uh, fix the problem the problem continued I was now uh, dreading the fact that I may have to reinstall the whole windows which I really didn't want to do uh, you know putting all the problems again and all that so I said let me give it one more try, uh, stay positive. So I went back to the soft, to MD software, I uninstalled the driver again, and then I proceeded to custom, custom install um, uh, the AMD drivers. I, you know, I didn't install that, I didn't install the audio as well because I don't need them. If you do, you know, leave them, but I installed the display driver. Actually, I did install that, sorry. So I installed this two and this one, I didn't install this one. And I then obviously click install that for me install the latest driver and I'll show you now so here right here so that installed for me the 17.5.1 uh, crimson driver and as we can see the problem has been fixed guys and now when we go to the device manager we can see uh, that the cars are working they're all fine and comparing to uh, right here as we can see uh, they were not being recognized they were not working and now uh, that this is all done, uh, I'm gonna run the the miner, and hopefully it's all working fine. And then I'm gonna show you guys uh, how to obviously uh, turn off the Windows update, so hopefully you don't experiencing this problem, guys, because it, it really is a. I mean, it sometimes you can fix it easy, but sometimes as you saw yourself, it takes a while, and if you don't know what you're doing, you could start getting frustrated, and you know, obviously, uh, kind of like not knowing what to do is a bit of a you know it's a bit of a struggle so as we can see all cards were recognized I'm just gonna see if we're getting the mega hashes for the Ethereum mining and then I quickly gonna show you how to uh, turn off the updates so if you actually disable the updates guys hopefully you would not have that problem uh, because uh, Windows would not be just uh, updating itself without asking you in a way so as we can see cards are working it will take a moment just to obviously recognize all of them to get them back up and running uh, this one is a 24 mega hashes simply because uh, I haven't done nothing to this card because it's you know it's it's not working with the settings for some reason uh, it keeps obviously losing the mega hashes so I've just put it, I, I've made a video about it guys so you feel free to check out the I think the video before that I talked about this uh, card so yeah, there you have it guys, all running. If I let it stay for a while, they will get to the right uh, mega hashes, but I'm happy with that. So all done. Although it took me a while, it's all done. But hopefully, this video will help you out uh, to fix the problem quicker if you have the same problem or if you are experiencing in the future. 
But the most important thing will hopefully now we will uh, prevent this problem happening at all. So click on here. Uh, this is how I go to the updates the services. Enter. Go down to Windows Update. Right here. Uh, and as you can see, for me, it's already disabled. Now, when you come for you, could be automatic or manual. Uh, let me apply. So you may have it like this. So let me click OK. Then when you come back here guys you may have it like this so I'll click what you want to do is click here disable apply and this will obviously now not have these buttons that you can press however the first time you come here you may have to press the stop as well here and then apply make sure you do that guys so you can prevent the windows updates of messing up your rig because it does happen guys a lot of people have experienced that problem in the past I thought I disabled actually the updates but maybe I didn't or maybe Windows just decided to obviously guys uh, put them back on on his own and this is what I also advise you if not every day every other day you know just as you saw it takes a moment you know it takes two seconds let me show you once more you click here right services uh, you go down uh, okay you see I put it down and then it goes back up that's Windows for you uh, so you know as you see it takes uh, very quickly to come to uh, the update and for some reason Windows may decide to just put it back on guys so you want to check it every other day if not every day just to see if it's still disabled if it's not put it back on because you don't want just like myself one day to come back home let's say and find out that the rig is not working because uh, you may find it out find you know discover it after five hours ten hours or even a day if you're away or something so it really is a pain uh, finding out your rig not working so there you have it guys this is how I disable the updates if there are any other ways so you want to give me any inputs in the comment section feel free to do uh, that so I can learn from you and of course everybody else who is reading the comment section can also learn from us and yeah I really hope you enjoy this video I hope it does uh, help you out uh, you know with uh, the problem if you are uh, having it or if you if it does happen to you in the future and also hopefully you can prevent it by disabling the updates if you if you haven't done this already well thank you for watching guys uh, if you are enjoying the channel feel free to subscribe and share one thing I gotta tell you guys uh, when you have issues like this with your rig you're thinking you know what I'm you know what in a way I'm glad that there is companies like Genesis Mining because obviously in there you don't have to go through all this trouble they are mining they're doing this work for you and this is why I'm glad I have invested with them as well so I can you know, I can be uh, earning from, from my rigs and from Genesis Mining. And if you are really, you know, thinking of investing with Genesis Mining, obviously watch the videos I made about it. Do your calculation. If you, and if you decide to do so, feel free to use my 3% discount code in the description or in the comment section. And I'll be very grateful for it. Thank you guys for watching. And I do hope really you enjoy this video. But most importantly, it is useful to you as well. Bye-bye for now.